dedicated to the proposition that all men are created equal. seven years ago. Our fathers brought forth on this continent a new nation conceived in liberty and dedicated to the proposition that all men are created equal. And now we're engaged in the great civil war. Testing whether that nation or any nation so conceived and so dedicated can long endure. We are met on a great battlefield of that war. We have come to dedicate a portion of that field as a final resting place for those who here gave their lives. That that nation might live. It is altogether fitting and proper that we should do this. But in a larger sense, we cannot dedicate. We cannot consecrate. We cannot hallow this ground. Okay. Brave men living and dead. Who have struggled here have consecrated. Far above our poor power to add or detract world will little note, nor long remember what we say here. But it can never forget what they did here. It is for us the living. Rather to be dedicated here to the unfinished work, which they who fought here have thus far so nobly advanced. It is rather for us to be here dedicated to the great task remaining before us. That from these honored dead we take increased devotion to that cause for which they gave the last full measure of devotion. That we here highly resolve that these dead shall not have died in vain. That this nation shall have a new birth of freedom. And that government of the people. By the people. <laughs> for the people. Shall not perish from this earth. As a final resting place for here, who those gave their. <laughs> <laughs> and so dedicated what? And so dedicated. Give him the paper. Can long endure. <laughs> and so dedicated, so long endure. I gotta be serious. I'm sorry. Can I start again? <laughs> Just go. Okay. That that nation might live. <laughs> it is all together. Rather fitting and proper that we should do this. The world with will. Bleh.